here. Do you think I've changed? Your dad, yeah. <laughs> right. So, I've been meaning to ask you about the, um, the, um, you know, that thing you did. <laughs> what thing? The kiss, okay, the kiss. What kiss? The kiss, the one you gave me. Oh, the kiss. What kiss, she says. <laughs> well, what about it? Just, nobody's ever wanted to kiss me before. Want to? I didn't want to. We were about to be eating a lion. Well, I was just sitting there and you grabbed and me. For heaven's sake, such a fuss. Didn't you like it? No, it was... You didn't like it? You didn't like it? And now you're telling me you didn't like it? Unbelievable! I didn't say I didn't like it. Mmm. Pork. Then what are you saying? I guess I'm saying... I guess I'm asking... You stop that right now! I won't answer any such question. You're inclining toward the sentimental, and that's all well and good for a boy. Inclining toward what? But the fact is, we girls can't afford to be sentimental. We must instead be strong. And when I marry... Whoa! Oh, marry? <laughs> you thought I was asking you to marry? Not you, you swat. The ego. And when I marry, I shall make it very clear to this person God. that sentimentality is not on the calendar. He will have to love it or leave it. <laughs> and, and if he should leave, I, I just take his pizza and pin my hair back and volunteer weekends at the hospital. <laughs> and I will love words for their own sake. Like hyacinth and piccadilly <laughs> and onyx. And I'll have a good old dog. And think what I like. And be part of a different sort of family. With friends, you know, who understand that things are only worth but you're willing to give up for them. Even if I, in the face of death, I may have, you know. Wanted to. I didn't say that. Got it. Go on, 
on the bay. He shipwrecked sailors looking here. He waves all square In, they eat it, they die. <gasps> they come, Captain. Let's kill us some kiddies, Smee. So nasty, so very nasty. <laughs> so hungry, so very hungry. There's the longboat. But where's Daddy? <laughs> Give your tears to fruit cake here. <laughs> Give your nice slice of fruit cake. Oh my gosh, yes! Ted, don't! Fresh out of the big house, yummy yum yum. <laughs> What's that? An echo! 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 <laughs> 
Excellent effect. The stash is coming. Coming. The stash is big guys. Going. The stash is supreme. I don't. So you, me, theater. He's alive. We're safe. Trust in Perry, Peter. Attack Kune Vilastra. Come on, Peter. Come on. And so we arrive in the belly of the beast. Teddy, throw it. Think first! Really, after all that! Sorry, SpongeBob. Good friend is in the Wait, 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 I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Is he crying? Seriously? <laughs> God, no, we have Next! I Oh, looky Lou, a baby koala. A koala? That's just so adorable! <laughs> Unfair! Say your goodbyes, my dear. Wait! Don't you want the trunk? Peter, don't! Are you guys with me? You go, said Mother. She's more pulled some truck. Even if I never get home. <laughs> Are we quite done with the hugging and learning? <laughs> It's a better world with you in it, Molly. Now let her go! Do you know if that's me? Do you see it? Genuine heroic sacrifice. Inspiring captain! I've got goose flesh all over! Horse me! How glad and unprofitable the world must seem from the deck of the HMS Cynic! Go, lad. Take your precious lady and live another day. My first mission and I wrecked it! Now open, Smee! Open and elaborate! It's. 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 I don't like it. Bollocks to it. Do we detect a pattern here? <laughs> Help me, the linguists among you, what's the turn of phrase? Empty, sir. So it is. Empty? It can't be empty. You mean all this time? Where's my treasure? It must have dissolved in the waves. Goose nuggets, moose nuggets. <laughs> Gold and diamonds don't dissolve. But star stuff does. Is that right, Daddy? Well, actually, the molecular framework of star stuff begins to break down. Starbucks, Starbucks, what is Starbucks? <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't matter now. Nobody gets his hands on it. Nobody gets what he wants. Enough of this conversation. <laughs> Is why I hate. I hate. I hate.
crocodile tears me. Oh, pine, if you would, what am I to do now? I'm stumped, sir. Yes, <laughs> It's all about you, isn't it? Selfie, self, self. Not I, sir. Then kindly <coughs> retrieve it. No. I'm not leaving me hand behind for these children to pour. <laughs> retrieve, Captain. <laughs> you. You sacrificed willingly for the sake of a girl. 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 And that was majestic. You've piqued the poet and me, Pan. What say we merge a forger? Forger, merger. Thank you, Spain! <laughs> Picture it, Pete. The ultimate pirate and his worthy opponents. But Molly's a better fighter than me. I run faster too. And I bet your milkshake brings all the boys to the yard. <laughs> But I'm not interested. <laughs> Consider the possibilities. Foes forever, adversaries ad never end them. I'm talking books, movies, Broadway. But you just tried to kill me. Don't you get it, Carter? <laughs> You're my hero. Me? You're the yin to me yang, the semi to me colon. Dang it, boy, you're the wind beneath my clipped wing. <laughs> I hadn't really. Thanks to you, I am reborn. The complete villain. <laughs> <laughs> what sublime enemies there will be. Forget gold, time, time will be our treasure. We'll fight for all eternity. We's a couple now, boo. <laughs> only, only if my friends go free. Oh, Romo, Romo, give the pan a round of the. It's me, a little help. <laughs> Single-handedly rendered me. Single-handed. <laughs> you put off your own hand, not me. Oh, pity the child who lives in a fact-based world. <laughs> you may think my ship has sailed, but I have an armada of options at my former fingertips. <laughs> Perhaps I'll never be a concert violinist or a reliable juggler. <laughs> But I can still win Wimbledon. <laughs> and I can still destroy you. You've made your bed, Pam. <laughs> Go on. Get the hook. <laughs> Upstaging me still, you snaggle to show off. Just not your day, sir. Hang on. I could use a killer croc on my crew. Bring the beast along, sing. How am I to learn, sir? Give him the hand, you fool. <laughs> Wait, best to make it last. Just give him the finger. And you, Pan. But believe this, where you call home, keep your back to the wall. For just when you least expect it, there I'll be. The stash right under your nose. <laughs> Clap if you believe. <laughs> Molly, 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 Molly,
fighting Prawn on it. Boy, where we're hat of Europe, and fighting Prawn will bend on a slope. Allow all English to leave out. Here we go, to Betty, for I'll serve you about it. Oh, we made friends, your Prawnness. I got down on Betty G, and Mrs. B said, You bachelor! Let his bound for bridal bliss! Aye. The HMS bone break may have a few barnacles on her bottom, but Al will scrape them off! Don't speak, dearie. <laughs> oh, Bronny. <laughs> TTS then! Ta-ta for now. Or in my language, tiramisu! 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 <laughs> Back to England, and I can set my sights on the South Pole. Yeah, can't it? For I can't rob a Belgian Scot. Drunk to the longbow. Good luck, Captain. Don't let the Norwegian reach you to the base. Nobody needs the British girl. Who can call it young? Not a little girl, a full fledged star catcher. A full fledged star catcher? Just like my wonderful father. She deserves it, sir. Molly's the true hero. Thanks, Peter. Mission fulfilled. We're headed home. And you'll come with us. Catch me, Daddy! Catch the boys! Come home with us! Mother, I told you! And teacher said all I needed to get home was faster! Ha! <laughs> Wrong! Who? Who's teacher? This tricked out mermaid! <laughs> well, she used to be a fish, but she swam in the grotto. And now we're going home! Wait, what grotto? The grotto with the golden water. Did you go in that water? Yeah, it was all warm and tingling. Wow. The star stuff! And he's soaked in it. We can't do this. But it's already dissolved in the waves! The waves that turn fish to mermaids. I'm sorry, Peter. We can't take you with us. What? What I do? But he isn't evil or greedy, and he isn't. We don't know what he is, or what he wants to be. I, I just want to be a boy for a while. That's all I've ever wanted. There, you see. With star stuff, a while could be a very long time. Oh, I we could. I promise. The boy deserves a home. Of course he does, but wait, Leonard, old man, you're getting slow. Peter, what if your mermaid was right? She wasn't right, and neither are you. Grown-ups lie. They lie and they leave. I thought she said the star stuff was all you needed to. But I'm still here. Precisely. Did she say anything else? She said I needed a family name, so she gave me one. Pam. Pam as in all. Probably. All? Your family name. The whole island, understand? All the ants on the beach, all the birds in the air, the mermaids, the mollusks, the pirates, and the boys too. Of course, especially the boys. They're your family. And how does that make you feel? Like, like, like I'm finally out of the dark. There's a name for that feeling, Peter. Home! And here you are. And here, they'll say. Yeah, totally, count me in. You didn't want to be alone, did you? Well, this is just so unacceptable. We asked just do not leave boys behind. Whoa, that crazy bird again. What do you want, bird? Leave me alone. Stop, don't hurt that bird. You're going to need something to protect you. Now, it seems to me, we take the last of the star stuff and stir vigorously. I think it's anti-clockwise. Peter, lend a hand with the meringue. It's getting all warm, just like and so warm. Ah, my hair! Hey, come back here, you! I can totally do that trick. Come on, Teddy, don't eat it. <laughs> I know I still got. If you really want to protect him, you take him with us. I'm going out, Lord. 
I'm afraid it's time for goodbye. Be a woman. This is my address in London. You don't have to write to me every day or anything. Just when you feel like it. Well, you know my address. Molly Island. Mollus Island, you mean. Or, or maybe I call it Neverland. You know, to remember. Hat of Hero. Wear it when you get home. To remember. Molly, now. The tide won't wait. I want you to look after Prentice and Teddy. Come on, five more minutes. I'm back. I'm sorry. Tell me, Molly. Tell me. Tell me how the tides won't there. See, she wants to stay. She can't. But I don't want it to end. Soon, Peter. You'll forget. And it won't hurt anymore. No! It's supposed to hurt. That's how you know it meant something. This isn't the end. You're going to remember everything, every single detail. And you're a better leader. Really? No. <laughs> <laughs> you won't stay mad at me forever, will you? Go on. Get lost. I'm bound to grow up. See? What did we do? Be friends. In a year, that would be hard. In five years, it would be silly. In twenty years, it would just be sad. You sound older already. The thing you did against impossible odds. It's what the two of you will always have. <coughs> the thing we did. Against impossible odds. about Molly, about that kiss. It would be the only moment that Peter would teeter at the top of the roller coaster, on the verge of becoming what he'd always hated, a grown-up. And then, as promised, he began to forget and stayed right where he was, the outsider. Molly, true to her word, would remember everything until one night, many years later, she stared out the nursery window, watching Peter fly off with her daughter in tow. And this grown-up Molly would comfort her new Nana, the good old dog who tended her children. Don't worry, Nana darling. I always hoped if Peter came to visit that my daughter would go in my place. And once Wendy grows up... I hope she will have a little girl. A little girl who will go off with him in turn. And so may we go on and on, dear Nana, as long as children are young and innocent. And rude and juvenile and punished. <laughs> as all the jostles of life. Till we fly back home. Home! Oh, yes! Mm. Yes, 
so good. It's hard to believe you're still single. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. How can I race them down to the grotto if I don't run? Whoa, whoa, whoa. I can watch. What'd she say? Come on, what'd she say? To have faith is to have wings. Wait a minute. Did you say grotto? How'd you like to just be a boy for a while? <laughs> you start some walk and do that. It makes you what you want to be. A lawyer? <sighs> wow. Guys, this is going to be one awfully big adventure. All right. You said it. Ready, 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 set, set, set. go! Good job, Mike.